Did the success that you had then, knowing that you kept, when it finally happened and you clicked into that gear, that you kept yourself whilst while finding the sound, did that give yeah. you confidence to, to follow your arrow as an artist from that point to go, you know what, I can, I can be this person, I can hold who I am and carry this through whatever I do? We played all these clubs here in town. A lot of them aren't here anymore. There was a guy that used to come to see us play. Um, his name is Cliff Aldridge. He worked at Sony Records. And he would come to every gig. He'd be sitting out the front. I came off one night and I'm like, Cliff, you're here. Like, every time we play, you're here. He goes, oh, I love you guys. And I said, then how come we can't get signed? He goes, oh, I'm the only one who loves you. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, and I said, what, are, what am I doing wrong? Like, what am I doing wrong? And he said, you're not doing anything wrong. He just said, you're just really unique and it'll be, it'll be your biggest curse until it becomes your greatest blessing. Mm -hmm. And whatever that sequence of words were in that moment, it, man, it went right to the core of me. And I guess I just interpreted it as, yeah, I guess I am really different to everything else, but I've got to stay the course. Because when I do figure it out, as long as I don't lose this thing that I am, when I figure out how to get it to fit in and my timing's here, it will have been worth it. Mm. So stay the course, don't, don't lose sight of it.